they're actually judging and they're asking, have you lied, have you stolen, have you committed adultery, have you cheated on somebody, blah, blah, blah. If that person, and that person's heart is put on a scale, depending on the answers they give, okay, if the heart is lighter than a feather, which it is here, they get to pass through. If their heart is heavier than a feather, they get devoured. And so in this, all this writing in here, the sacred text is a sacred text, is, are the 42 confessions. Only Gabe knows what they say because he actually wrote them out. And he has actually, they're actually magic. When you write them or you say them, they evoke a magic in your life. And I don't know what they mean, but Gabe, having written them out, <clears throat> may have evoked the magic. He may not even realize how it's going to manifest until so two weeks later he's on TV hitting the lottery or some great thing happens. <laughs> but essentially it's the old Jesus story, that we, old Christian Jesus story that we've all grown up with. It originates from this story. It originates from what's called the Papyrus of Ani. So, there's a guy by the name of Wallace Budge around the 18th century, a British guy who went into Egypt at a time when they had discovered the great artifacts and monuments in Egypt. He went looking for treasures and accumulated thousands of pieces of treasure. You could go into the, to the British Museum and see all of these massive treasures that he accumulated. He was the one person who was the curator of the British Museum. Right now, for Cairo, it's that Halas, Howells, Leslie guy, I forget his name. But each of these museums has a major person that's actually a go-to per, go person if you want to get something from the museum or have permission to seek out the resources inside and investigate them. But Wallace Budge was instrumental in finding this papyrus, which was 72 pieces long. And the only discredit they attribute to him in, in connection with this piece is that he cut it and lost the sequence forever. Because he cut it in an attempt to try to make it easier for him to understand it. You know how you have a, 